Hi guys, welcome back. Today's video is a bit special and I've been wanting to do it for a long time because we're going to talk about an artist who made me want to make this kind of music, the one and only Dope Drop. Today Dope Drop has completely changed his style. He preferred to dedicate himself to a new genre, which is a halfway between bass house and G house, which is great by the way, so go check that if you haven't done it before. But in this video we will focus on his whole production, not on his melodic band style, but rather on the style he develops in tracks such as Get Them High, What The Fuck Are Getting High. If you want to help the channel, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button, and maybe check some of my other videos if you like this one. So yeah, let's just get into it. First of all, I chose this vocal. Baselines, they burn up when I'm here, we turn up. I wish I had the dry version of this, but unfortunately I don't. Since we want our kick to hit as hard as possible, I applied heavy side chin on this to give it maximum space. Baselines, they burn up when I'm here, we turn up. Then I chose this trumpet lead and wrote the melody in A minor. This will obviously sound like dub drop since he made a couple of tracks in this specific scale. Once it's done, we can start writing the introduction of the track. A simple way to do this is to chop some melody parts. It's great because it doesn't reveal the whole melody right away and it's just enough to catch the listener's attention. Now just add that fat bass line. Obviously you want to cut the sub on the first 8 bar and throw the mash when the vocal gets in. This way you will get that wow effect everyone is expecting. Be sure to put dope fills before this with some hype vocal like these ones. Everybody make it these are incredibly important to satisfy your listeners, so don't underestimate it. And be sure to add every feel, vocal, perk you like in your library so that you have maximum creativity when you need to write these kind of transitions. Let's move on to the build up now. I kept it quite standard. FXs, snare roll and filtering is all we need. Build up is the part of the song where you need to keep some elements of your verse and introduce some elements of your draw. I consider it as a giant transition between two moments of your song, if that makes sense. I also added this crowd ambience. you can find on my sample selection. It's super useful to fill the empty space here. Looping the melody is one of the most common way to create some tension before the drop. Some would argue that it's very simple, but it works and that's a better argument. Moving on to the drop. To keep things interesting, the drop often use multiple leads. So I chose this thin sample and this vocal chop. To make the drop even more interesting, I added stabs, white noises, vocals and some random samples I felt fit nicely where they are. <laughs> I also add this crazy idea. I, don't give a I like how it sounds, it's just so satisfying so even if it's crazy and unusual I think it sounds good so it's good. <laughs> I also encourage you to remove the bass at some moment of the drop, especially at the beginning of a melody phrase. Play with it until you find something that suits your melody. Rendering, mastering. Stand up. 
If you made it till the end, you're a legend. Please leave a like and subscribe. Remember that you can get all my sh** for $5 on Patreon. Link is in the description. I'd like to thank my patrons. I owe you guys. Thank you and see you soon for another tutorial. Bye.